Hey everyone, today I'm going to show you how to get music off your Apple iPod onto your Windows based computer. So uh, what you need is an iPod with enable disk use checked so you can see the do not disconnect on the iPod screen. I know that this method will work with iPod videos and anything that uses an internal hard drive. Um, I'm not 100% sure if it works with the iPods that use flash memory like the iPod Shuffle, the iPod Nanos and the iTouches and iPhones. So you can try this out, see if you can get the computer to recognize it as an external drive and then if you can this will work. So uh, let's take a look at the screen. Now that we're in Windows, ensure that enable disk use is checked on your iPod. To do this, open up iTunes go to your iPod and make sure enable disk use is checked. Now you want to find your iPod in my computer. Enter it. Now hit Alt, Tools, Folder Options, View, Show Hidden Files, Folders and Drives. Now you should see iPod Control appear. Double click this, go to Music. Now you're in the music folder, this is where all the music on your iPod is stored. However, you won't be able to read what track it is here, as it's all done in code. This code can be read by your media player and will be converted automatically into text that you can understand. So what you want to do is select the music that you want. Normally you'll select it all because you're not 100% sure what you're copying. And then paste it onto your desktop or any folder that you choose. Now that it's finished pasting, right click the folder, hit properties and untick hidden. This is so when you change the settings back to normal you'll still be able to find your folder. Now that your folder is visible you want to add it to iTunes. To do this hit start, go to music, iTunes, iTunes media, and automatically add to iTunes. You'll want to drag and drop your music that you've just copied from your iPod into this folder. The next time you open iTunes the music will automatically be added and organized so that you can read the files when you browse in your Explorer. The next time you open iTunes all the music will be added automatically. So let's take a look at what this will be like. And there it is, all the music from your iPod with the song names already written in. And if you go back into your Explorer and you look at where the files are, you can see that they have all the file names written for you in a format that you understand. It has file name, artist, album, and title. And that's about concludes this. This is everything you really need to know about getting music from your iPod to your computer on a Windows based system. I'm not 100% sure the method of doing it using other operating systems. I think it is compatible with Ubuntu Linux so as you can view hidden files doing by clicking Control H I think and I am not familiar of using an Apple Mac so I don't know if this method is possible although I think that there are programs that you can get which can do this for you I'm sure if you google it you'll get pretty good results so again thanks for watching my video if you liked it please leave a comment anything that you can say is helpful say what you want to see in the future or if you didn't understand any of the steps please leave a comment and I'll get back to you as soon as I can and I'll try and be as helpful as possible. So that's about it. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.